Hey, it's Lindsay. Today for our workout of the day, we're gonna be doing a travel chipper wad. It's perfect for anywhere, you don't have any equipment, and we're gonna start right now. All right, let's go ahead and get started. So our first exercise is gonna be lunge, lunge, squat and we're getting started right now. So each exercise is gonna be 40 seconds of work with 20 seconds of rest. So lunge, lunge, squat. Good, from the front, lunge, lunge, squat. Good, trying to keep that chest upright, those feet flat on the ground, and making sure those knees are tracking over top of those second toes, good. Only about five more seconds left. Keep it up. Three, two, one. Good, shake it out. Our next exercise is gonna be push-ups. Here we go, down to the ground. Starting in 10 seconds. And you can do these on your knees or in regular standard push-up shape. Here we go, two, one, and go. So, touch that chest. Push all the way up. Good. Trying to get as many good push-ups in this 40 seconds as you can. Good, keeping that core nice and tight, making sure you're not sagging or pushing up too high. Good. About 10 seconds left. And remember, you can always do knee push-ups too. If you start to get tired, that is great too. And two, one, good, and rest. Next exercise is V-ups. So we're going onto our back. 10 seconds until we start. We're gonna be lifting up and trying to reach past our legs in three, two, one. And here we go down on the ground, reach up past our legs. Good, and so the harder version of this is holding a hollow at the bottom, and the easier version is laying all the way down and then coming up. Good, so if you can, hold that hollow position, go right back up. If you're having trouble balancing, you can always put those arms down and let them help guide you. Good, 10 seconds, almost there. In three, two, one, and rest. Next exercise is gonna be half burpees. So we're going down on the ground into a push-up position, but no push-up. And then coming right back up and doing a little hop. And here we go, five seconds. In three, two, one, and here we go. Push up and jump. Push up shape, jump up. Down and up and down and up. See how many you can fit in. Try and fit in as many as you can. Good. Making sure you're hitting a tight push up position here, not sagging in your back. And up, 10 seconds. Good, almost there, three seconds, two, one. Good, and rest. Next exercise is gonna be sit-ups. So we're gonna be touching our back on the ground, reaching behind, touching our hands, coming up and touching our heels or the ground in front of us. And here we go, three, two, one, and go. Down and touch. Reach down. Keep going, as many as you can fit in. We have 30 seconds left. Using that core. Good, keep it up, 20 seconds. As many as you can do, 10 seconds left. Almost there. 
three, two, one. Good, and rest. Next exercise is gonna be a little bit of a challenge. They're gonna be air squats, so here. But as a challenge, we're gonna try and keep our arms up to the ceiling, working that active shoulder flexibility, and this will help out so much with overhead squats. In three, two, one, and go. Arms up, trying to hold them up, trying to keep those elbows nice and straight. And you want those shoulders to be right next to your ears while maintaining that good squat position. So nice flat feet on the ground, knees over top of those toes. Good, and trying to keep that chest upright. So not letting your hands pull you over. This is a great thing to work on every day. 10 seconds. Good, really working hard to keep those arms up. And two, one, good, and rest. Shake it out if you need to. Good, next exercise, back lunges. So we're standing at the back of our, at the front of our mat, and we're gonna be stepping backwards and in. Backwards and in, here we go. Two, one, and go. Alternating sides. Good, trying to fit as many as you can into this 40 seconds of work time. Oops. And also balancing while you do it because balance is also an essential part of fitness. Good, keeping that chest upright, not letting your chest get pulled over like that. Keeping it nice and up. 10 seconds left. Good, and three, two, one. Very nice, shake it out. Next exercise, full burpees. Regular, all the way down, touching that chest, jumping up at the top. Starting in 10 seconds, so shake it out if you need to, because we are almost ready to go in three, two, one. Good, down to the ground, do that push up. Feet in and jump, good. Down, push up, feet in and jump. Fifteen seconds in. Keep it moving more than halfway. Ten seconds left. Almost there, five seconds. Last one. And two, one. Good, and rest. Next exercise, pike handstand push-ups. So we're here. This is a little bit of a flexibility challenge too, but if you have to, you can always bend those knees. And we're gonna try and touch our head in the front in the shape of a triangle. So our hands are the bases, and your head is gonna be the top. Here we go. Pushing up into that down dog position, and we're gonna touch our head in front. And down, and push to open. Push to open. Keep a nice rhythm. Not letting your body turn this into a straight line. Remember, keep it as a triangle. seconds. Good, and rest. Whew. Gotta let the blood go back to the rest of my body. Shake it out. We have one more exercise, and that is for our abs. It's our suitcase sit-ups. So we're gonna be on the mat, sitting, and we're gonna be starting in that hollow position and bringing our legs in. And here we go, two, one, and down, hollow, and up into that suitcase. Down, and up. Good, as many as you can fit in. We have about 25 seconds left. Good. Keep going as many as you can do. When you go down, try not to let that back arch like that, keeping it nice and flat on the mat. To make this a little bit easier, you can always leave those arms down. 
three seconds, two, one, good, and a rest. And shake it out if you need to. And we are all done with this workout. Very good job today. Make sure to hit the like button if you like this video and hit the subscribe button to see more workouts just like this one every day. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks so much for working out with me today. Let me know in the comments how that workout went for you and also make sure to leave me a like if you like this video. I release a new workout just like this one every day, so make sure to subscribe to my channel so you can see all the new workouts. Also, if you wanna get even fitter, check out this video. I'll see you guys tomorrow.